So Clash Weekend's here, and I've been streaming and grinding, and people come in and ask what tools I use to remember what I where I've gone, what cards I've already revealed, and how I remember. That way I don't replay it. Well, in this video, not only will I go over some of the tips that I use, but we'll go ahead and get into some gameplay. We'll also have some pack openings near the end of it and a, a fusion, a couple fusions to see if we get that exclusive Brock. But let's get into the video. Before we do, don't forget, like, subscribe, and turn on those post notification bells. That way you never miss a video that goes live on the channel. Let's get into it. So how many times have you guys got to this screen and you just see that it's just one card and you have all these cards and you want to like you lose your mind because how can I keep track of where I've already gone in this video we're going to show you I'm going to show you what I do again whatever works for you guys I know there's an app out there that has the board that you can cross off and reset every level that's great for me as a streamer that just takes time away from the stream so i go the same pattern every time obviously this only works once you hit 123 because it's the same board every time so we're gonna start one thing that i will say guys is peaks is definitely not the way to go in clash they're super expensive and once you get up to these high level boards it just gets way too way too costly I think it's like 1,200 or 1,000 credits every five levels, assuming you don't mess up and forget where you've already gone, because I want to say it's 1,000 credits for 60 peaks, and there's 24 cards that you have to reveal on the board, so that's 12 per level, so it's just not worth it. So I always start in the middle. I go left, and then I'll go up. And another thing while doing it this way to get the most out of the cards in your deck, you always want to press the one stat. Don't press the card. Press the one stat. That way, when you go through on round two, you have fresher cards in more stats. Because if you just pick the card, you can get power charisma, power toughness, power speed every time. That way, the second time you're going around, your cards are more depleted because of the fact that you use multiple stats on each time. So we didn't find it within the first five. So now we're going to go into round two. Once we beat Undertaker. So we'll start. I'm not going to refresh any of my cards. Again, not worth it. The only thing, if you are spending that you want to use credits on, are going to be bounce. That's that's the best way to do it. If I do so say so myself. Again, people have different methods that get them up to the top of the leaderboard or get them to the rank that they want. And I'm a firm believer in whatever works for you. So now that we've cleared out this little this little path, you have two different options now. You can clear off these two to clear off the bottom nine, or you can clear off these two because they're farther away from the center. For the for this video, I'm gonna clear off the bottom two because they're farther away. We're gonna hope by picking charisma it doesn't land on Roman. It didn't, which is great. Let me know in the comment section below, guys, where you are in Clash right now. I'd really, really like to hear where you guys are, what you guys are grinding for, what, what your aim is for the weekend. My aim is honestly just for a number that I don't already have within the purple ranks. So we've been grinding pretty nonstop since the start of the event. Now, this is where it gets tricky because no matter where you go here, you're going to have to probably play the card again. We're going to go right next to it. We're not going to find it. So now I know that I've cleared out that area. So when we go into another bout, I'm going to know not to worry about those. And again, they say, well, how do you remember? It's just muscle memory. Just, just the same pattern over and over and over again. That way, it's just second nature to where you guys go and things like that. The last thing you want to do is confuse yourself. We are skipping picks just because... They're too time consuming. So we're in bout number two. So this is where you can either go down or you can go up and clear this top spot. So we're gonna go up and clear the top spot. 
Now here, I have no choice but to pick a two stat, so we're going to go with Toughness and Charisma. Let me know also in the comment section who you guys picked. I picked Shinsuke. I love that image. It's not that I'm not a Macho Man fan. It's just... I love Shinsuke, so it's nice to see him get an event card. It's his first event card from uh, Fusion Fury, since Fusion Fury, Shinsuke. So it's nice to see him get some love again. So we'll go up. Finally got some one statters, so we'll clear those out. This is probably going to be one of those that takes two or three bouts to find, which is fine. It gives me more content for the video. It gives me a chance to talk to you guys, see how you guys are doing. Make sure to tune in to stream all weekend. Twitch.tv backslash the real Hugie. We will be live most of the weekend. Later in this video. Oh, there we go. There's Macho Man. So it's not the the most points to get there. So, I mean, you could try to throw the, the level because it's only four here, whereas right now we're on our sixth card. But it's only a couple less points, so we're just going to go ahead and take the win. Maybe, depending on what. Yeah, we got the win with Rock, toughness and speed. And there we go. It's just a muscle memory thing. So definitely make sure that you... You find a pattern that works for you. That way you don't have to worry about forgetting where you've already gone within the level. All right. Next up, we have a couple fusions. One on my main account, one on my second account. And then we opened up the extreme, or not the extreme, uh, the remastered chance packs the day they came out. So enjoy what you guys see, and we'll see you on the other side. All right. We ready? We ready? I'm on floaty screen. I'm taking a screenshot real quick for the thumbnail because, you know, as a YouTube content creator, we have to do that now. Um, uh, so on uh, three, 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 two, one, go. Uh, you win because your second highest was a swarm. All right, number two. These packs are so bad. I win. My highest is a swarm. Uh, my second highest was a... Fuck, you won again because... Wait, no, no, no. Is Elemental higher than SummerSlam 20? No, it can't be. SummerSlam 20 was the last of the tier, and they're both the same season. So, yeah. So, we're tied. 1-1, one, one, chat. Tied 1-1. One, one. All right. On, on, on the floaty screen. All right. 3, 2, 1, go. Oh my god, these packs are so dog shit. Yeah, you won. You won. Let's let's just go to the next one. Go to the next one. Fuck this. Alright, come on. Oh, I I got a forge too. Yep, I win. <laughs> We're tied 2-2 two -two chat. <clears throat> Come on, Cena. Specials auto win you. Come on, Cena. Three, two, one, go. I got a Royal Rumble 21. I got a Summers. I got a Swarm. <laughs> Hoogie wins his first pack battle on YouTube. Let's go. Let's go, baby. All right, we didn't get Cena. Didn't get Cena. Let me know in the comment section below if you get anything in the packs, and we'll be back.
All right, guys, we are back on my second account. Still in the hunt for this Brock. We are going to open up these remastered packs over here. There's five of them. There's 700 credits each. Pack number one. Got nothing. Pack number two. Again, nothing. Third pack. Oh, my gosh. These are so bad. These are so bad. Everyone in chat saying hi, YouTube. We're filming this live on Twitch as we speak. Last chance, and we get nothing. I get I get a Meyer, which is the best out of the 10 packs that I did. But we'll be back. We're farming up that coin right now so we can try to speed up one of those fusions. All right, guys, we got our first coin and we started that fusion we're gonna go ahead and speed this up 355 credits let's see if we can get that remastered brock i doubt it but you never know you never know so we're gonna go ahead and finish now speed that up 355 credits and our first pack is going to be a maelstrom commander aziz phenomenal we'll be back for more all right we are back we got the coin on the second account we are going to throw some cards into this thing and see if we can get lucky and get brock 2251 activate we're going to speed this baby up let me know in the comment section below if you guys got brock if you got the pro 360 credits Let's see what we get. It's it's a Valhalla. And on this account, a female is still helpful. So I cannot complain. So we'll be back more with more later. Or this might be the end. We might do a clash preview. I don't know. We'll see where this video goes. But EO on the second account, I can't complain at all. Well, those packs were absolutely terrible. I cannot believe how bad those packs are, but you know what? I had to try to get that Cena after after stream deleted them, so I was willing to willing to pay the price to try to get Cena. I won't be doing them again, just because they're not really worth the the credits that you spend. I'm also zero for three now on Brock on my main account, so if we get them, we get them. If we don't, you know, say lovey. It's an exclusive image. I would love to get it, but at the same time, I understand it was one of the rarest images in the game, and I'm perfectly okay with keeping it that way. Again, don't forget, like, subscribe, and turn on those post notification bells, and drop a comment in the section, man. Even if it's saying hi or hello, you don't have to answer any of the questions. Just let me know what you guys are thinking about. Let me know how you guys like the content so far on the channel, and we will see you on the flip side. Thank <laughs> you.